Hi guys, in this video we will introduce how to recover the system via console port. To recover the Yeastar devices, below 4 tools are required. The physical console for Yeastar devices, get ready of putty tool, TFTP server tool and prepare the TA image file with EXD2 format. Now, we can start the operation. Firstly, press any key in the console after the timeout prompt to enter the bootloader interface. Then input the erase command to clear the all settings. Follow the information in the notepad and change the default TFTP server. Assume your TFTP server IP is 192.168.9.17 and default IP address get one available IP for you boot. Take 192.168.8.99 for example of you boot. You can use printf to check the server IP and a put review boot. Change Linux name to the firmware which you want to recover. In this example, we will recover TA800 with the firmware 41.19.0.32. Next step is upgrade the firmware. In this step, you boot will try to download firmware from TFTP server. Before firmware download, you can use the ping command to check if the network is reachable to the TFTP server. When the downloading and flashing process finished, input command RE to reboot the device to fish the whole recovery process. After the recovery, the IP address of the TA would be the fault 1, 192.168.5.150 with Netmask 24. Now you can assign an IP address to your computer within the same segment to access TA web interface. Alright, guys. This is what we in this video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Get more details about troubleshooting, check out our knowledge base. Get more information about system configuration, please visit our document center. I will see you guys in the next one.